In this video, we're going to be converting from Roman numerals to Arabic. So let's say Roman to Arabic. Alright, first thing we need to do is get a Roman numeral. So let's say we have M, M, C, M, L, X, V, I, I. So we'll start with a fairly long number. Before we actually convert this, let's write out what everything represents in the Roman numerals. So I is equal to 1, V is equal to 5, X is equal to 10, L is equal to 50, C is equal to 100, D is 500. We don't have that here, so it's not really a big deal to write out in this case, but we'll do it anyways. And M equals 1000. So I don't know why I started writing equals just on that one. Okay, so let's look at the number that we have. So we are starting out with two M's, and M is a thousand, so two M's would be two thousand. So two thousand. Then the next thing we have a C and then another M. Now if you remember, whenever we have a C and then a number, Whenever we have a lower number than a higher number, we're actually subtracting. So this is going to be 1,000 minus 100. It's 100, because the C means 100 subtracted from M, 1,000. So 1,000 minus 100. Next, we have an L to represent 50. So L is 50. I think we're going to leave the rest of this as a number in itself. Or we'll make that all one group. So x is equal to 10, v is 5, and each i is 1. So 10 plus 5 plus 2, that equals 17. We need to add that to 50. So 17 plus 50. We also need to add 1,000 minus 100, which is 900. And we also have 2,000. So, plus 2,000. Well, what would that be? That would be 2,957. Or, I'm sorry, 2,967. I forgot to carry this one over. So MMCMLXVII is equal to 2,967. 